Hi guys, been working on another little project. A couple of pizza tray uh, catapult launch gliders. People who've looked at my pizza trays before, when we've used these ones that have got the dimples on one side, have often asked which is the best way to have the dimples, on the top or on the bottom. So what I'm trying to do is make these two as identical as possible. They're the same weight, same design. The only difference is one's got the dimples on the top and one's got the dimples on the bottom. So I'm just trying to test glide them at the moment across the garden. I can't actually catapult launch them here because I'd like to think they'll go too far. So I just want to see if we can get a fairly level glide. And then if we get another suitable day, we'll try them out outdoors or in a field or something. So this one's got the dimples on the top. And this one's got the dimples on the bottom. Well, they didn't do that when I did a test throw before I started filming. Um, so I'll just do that again. Uh, dimples on the bottom. Dimples on the top. Doesn't seem to be any really big difference, but it might be different when we actually catapult launch them a bit higher and a bit faster. I'll give it one more go. Dimples on the top this time. Dimples on the bottom. Well, if anything, the one with the dimples on the top seems more stable. They've both got little dents in them now, which I don't want to do before we do proper flight tests. So, I'm tempted to put a fin on the back. But I think we'll leave that. We'll just try them as they are, outdoors somewhere. And they're both coming in at 19 grams at the moment. 19. Nineteen. So they're the same weight, the same design. That one's got dimples on top, that one's got dimples on the bottom. Hey, thanks for watching. There's plenty of videos on my main channel with more added daily, so don't forget to subscribe and enable the notifications to keep you up to date with my new releases. You can help keep my channel running by donating a dollar on Patreon to buy me coffee. You can always find more information in the video description. Thanks again for watching.